Good morning, Oak Ridge families. Happy Friday. Today is April 7th. I'm hoping I get this out uh, today. I have a uh, busy schedule um, ahead of me uh, on this Friday. Um, hanging out in the coach's classroom uh, right now. You can see kind of a neighborhood behind me. I think there's a little shot of the baseball field and uh, Hazel Point is, is back there um, somewhere. Um, and I mentioned Hazel Point. Uh, we're working on transitions now. Um, we've worked with high school staff. We're working with Hazel Point um, as we transition kids. Um, uh, to the building and, and to the high school um, and uh, that's what kind of we start doing in fourth quarter and here we are um, in fourth quarter. Uh, one thing I would love for you to talk to your uh, child about um, and, and a great conversation you can have with them this weekend is for them to talk about their quarter class. Um, I was walking around on Tuesday had forgotten that it was the beginning of fourth quarter and I heard teachers giving um, directions if there is a fire, directions if there is a, a storm uh, and where they go and everything and um, just remembered uh, that uh, it's the first day of school for a couple of our teachers on Tuesday uh, because it's back to kind of that, that beginning. So so talk to your kids about the, the, the quarter class they're in. Uh, a lot of hands-on activities or a lot of um, classes that uh, really prepare them uh, for their next level. So pretty cool. Um, chat with your kids about that. Uh, last week I sent um, ISASP and Conditions for Learning information. I'll send that again here in this email. Again, we're doing that the week of the 17th, so not next week, but the following. And uh, your student will be taking tests in the morning. Uh, on Monday the 17th, they'll be doing the Conditions for Learning survey. Please look through that um, if you want to opt your child out of that survey. Please let me know, fill that form out, send me an email, um, have your kid bring it, uh, whatever, however it's easiest. Give me a phone call um, and we can work through, uh, work through that part. Um, so that's coming up soon. Just checking my notes here. Um, I've got a, a link that I'm sending um, from the uh, Lindmar Foundation on their new endeavor, the Lion Games. Looks like it's the end of July and early August. I can't say enough about the Lindmar Foundation um, and the things that they've done for Oak Ridge Middle School and the district um, uh, itself. But uh, what a great organization, what a great foundation that really truly helps our teachers with things that they need in their classroom. So hats off uh, to the Lindmar Foundation. Take a look at this link and, and see how you can help support uh, Lindmar um, through their new endeavor, the Lion Games. I uh, got a lot of events. Um, last night we had our first track meet um, in Iowa City. Not sure how that went. Looked like the weather was not rainy, um, at least. Uh, maybe a little windy and chilly, but uh, we got track meet in last night. Uh, so next week we've got soccer on Monday, tennis on Tuesday and Thursday, and a track meet here at Oak Ridge on Thursday. I'll be there if you want to help out in any way. We have a blast at track meets. It's really cool to see the kids and be part of while they're competing and having conversations um, with them. If you're interested, please read out, reach out to, to Mike Moran um, and we'd love to have your help. Um, hopefully we've got some great weather. Um, sounds like it's, at this point it will be. Um, really fun times at our track meets here at, uh, at Oak Ridge. That's all I've got uh, for, for this weekend, or uh, for this week, excuse me. Uh, again, make sure you're reaching out if you have any questions on anything I've talked about or anything else that uh, uh, you have concerns about or just want to, to chat. So reach out to me um, if you have those. Have a great weekend. Take care.